an open letter to the Florida legislature. I'm reaching out today to express my disappointment at the thought of fracking taking place in the state of Florida. Florida, which is surrounded by water on three sides, which relies on its statewide aquifers for over 90% of public water, that is the home to the largest subtropical wilderness in the United States, should be treated with more respect. To allow companies to come into our state, drill, and force millions of gallons of chemicals, carcinogens, and poisons into the ground is reprehensible. Not only will it damage the ground we stand on, it will contaminate our oceans and Everglades, destroy our fragile ecosystem, and render our water undrinkable. Massive drilling will be necessary to obtain enough oil to make this venture worthwhile, but it will endanger the health of the people and wildlife that inhabit this beautiful state. Studies have shown that the sheer volume of fracking wells needed to be lucrative would literally destroy the state and its economy and put an end to tourism. Florida is nearly 1,200 miles of coastline, 11,000 miles of rivers, streams, and waterways, over 7,500 lakes, and is home to over 500 varieties of birds, over 88,000 sea turtle nests, and 550,000 acres of orange groves. If the goal is to become energy independent, why not take advantage of Florida's assets? Let's soak up the energy from the sun. Let's harness the ocean winds. Our water, our land, our lives are worth so much more than could possibly be obtained by letting these oil companies come into our state and fill it with poison. Allowing them to inundate our ecosystem with undisclosed toxins that we are powerless to vote against is a pure violation of our rights. I am speaking out as a citizen, a taxpayer, a voter. I do not want fracking in my state. No fracking way.